Hey everybody, it's Christina of Crafty Paws. I wanted to share with you guys a few birthday cards that I've made. I'm not going to say who uh, each card is for, so hopefully it'll be a surprise. But I share uh, a birthday sign with some folks, um, so I wanted to at least try to get some cards done. Um, I'm a very, very slow card crafter, and uh, so it's taken me a while, and I've been definitely stepping back from doing a lot of um, crafting. I've cut down to about half of what I normally have been doing previously, um, but I really wanted to do these. This little cutie image, I think maybe it's a Sherry Baldy, or I'm not sure. This was gifted to me by uh, Sarah Elliott. She's so pretty. And I've been practicing my Copic coloring, so I really am happy with how her hair came out. Um, I then added my really favorite, and of course it's not going to show up in this video, um, there's shimmer in the crinoline and in her dots on her dress um, from my Jelly Roll pen, the star, clear star. Um, and this person really loves black cats. <laughs> so I didn't have a cat stamp, so I drew this little kitty and I colored her in and I just, I thought, you know, why not? Give it a try. So I did, I just made that little, I guess it's a digi <laughs> for myself for the card. I used three, I think, papers from Bev, um, New Crafter Bev, she had gifted me. Um, and they were perfect for this card. I love the pinks and the reds. Um, I used this beautiful red trim that I'd gotten from Stargirl Annie. Thank you, Annie. And I believe these little tiny flowers. Ooh, I'm not sure who I got those from. Um, I want to say they're from, ooh, sorry, I'm not totally off frame. Um, from Rhonda. Uh, Heart Music Soul RJ, and they worked out really cute too, I think. And this little tiny lavender bow was also from Bev. I colored in the little girl and the kitty. I used glossy accents on her shoes and her eyes and the kitty's eyes, and I think that came out cute. The inside's just more of the pretty pattern paper. The next card I did was the second fairy that I got from Melissa D. This, I think she, this fairy was so pretty. And uh, I just added more of the um, clear star around the little fairy's dress and her hat. I added some green stickles to the little balls on her leaf top and on her hat. I put her on a white doily I got from Susumu, Nerdy Geek Crafter. And I used my Martha Stewart punch for the corners here and up here. Um, these beautiful green, light green butterflies are from Jay Colby, Jackie. Thank you, Jackie. And these beautiful um, lavender and purple and white crocheted flowers are from um, Brenda HDP77. Thank you, Brenda. I think it came out super, super cute. Um, I also added some little green and purple um, enamel dots that Bev made for me. Um, thank you so much, Bev. And the inside is just another one of Brenda's little hearts in the middle, and I haven't written the note yet, um, but I use that, that Martha Stewart doily punch all the way, punch around the page set to make the inside, and I'll make my little note in there. And lastly, this was another image from Sarah Elliott, and I, oop, stickles came off a little bit, that was still wet, hmm. Um, again, I use my Copic markers. I use more of the beautiful paper from Bev, and she also gifted me this uh, little strip of bling, and it matched perfectly with this color story. This flower trim came from Lisa, Maggie 2005 Cupcake. Thank you, Ma Lisa. And behind it, I have the little paper doily trim that came on a roll. I didn't realize it was a sticker. It's so easy to use. That was also from Bev. And this beautiful chair was from Laura. Laura loves lace. Thank you, Laura. And I think this came out super cute, too. I glossy accented her boots and her eyes, and I used, like, pink stickles over the um, kind of gray-silver color that I colored the heart key. And inside is just more of the pretty decorative paper. Thanks a lot for watching, everybody. I hope you guys are having a great day. Bye. And happy birthday to all you Aries.